Hey, your guys' questions like, hey. <laughs> like, come on. When you win, why aren't you playing netball anymore? I get this question a lot. channel um i hope you guys are good um as you're by the title i will be doing a q a hashtag get to know me tag i know people will normally do these things like at the beginning of their channel but make it but anyways so i'm gonna be answering questions i put a poll on my ig uh story and you guys have been like y'all sent questions and questions so i'm gonna be answering all those questions honestly but yeah before we get into this video guys please like comment share and subscribe share this video to your mother father brother sister uncle gogo auntie to do what support your girl okay so let me i boo let me get the questions at okay so i'm gonna just start from like the bottom i'm gonna start from the bottom and go to the top but anyways Let's get it. Okay, so I don't know if I'm gonna show. Ooh, cha. I don't know if I'm gonna be showing like the questions, like the you know, maybe like here or here or like I'm gonna write down. I think I'm gonna just write down the questions, or do nothing at all. Oh. Hey, your guys' questions, Clay. Hey. Okay, first question. <laughs> yeah. How's your relationship with Christ? My relationship with Christ is good. I've um, always been a follower of Christ, but I haven't been like fully devoted. I've been going to church, obviously, when I'm like, when I was like young and stuff. But now, things have changed. I am trying my best to be a fully devoted follower of Christ. So I would say my relationship with Christ is good. Yeah. Um. Okay. At this stage right now, it's better than like. A month ago or something like last year better way better I'm sorry for the noises you guys are gonna hear but anyways next question we are Jola no next question what do you value most in friendships I would say communication just any relationship in your friendship relationship communication is very important to me you know yeah uh yeah what's your biggest fear <laughs> what is my biggest fear my biggest fear I'm, I'm just gonna be honest it's judgment day yeah when not judgment day but then at the same time okay it used to be judgment day because okay Firstly, it used to be losing my parents. That's that was like, <sighs> um, and then it was Judgment Day because of how I could not forgive myself for the past, for the things I've done in my past. I couldn't forgive myself. I couldn't move forward from all of the things I've done, the pain I caused other people. So I was like, yeah, God, He's gonna judge me for this. <laughs> But listen, I've changed. I'm different. And yeah, that's why I'm saying my relationship with God is better. So, or Christ is better. Because. Yeah. Next question. Do you have a boyfriend? No, I do not. Next question. How did you become a Christian? I be Okay, I, it started... 2022 okay hold on don't mind my nail i have been like i said a fully ah i've been a follow <laughs> i've been a follower of christ i've been i've been i've been i've been but not fully devoted so now it's changed and i started 
being more invested you know so it started in 2022 Yeah, started in 2022. Period. Woo! This thing, this question. When is your birthday? It is currently the 12th of January. My birthday is on the 14th of January, so it's in two days. <sighs> yeah, it's in two days. It's on the 14th. Whatever. Your zodiac sign. I used to believe in those things, eh? Now I don't. My sign is the cross. Yeah. Yeah, it's 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 the cross. Um, but if you were to like probably Google or whatever, it's Capricorn. So yeah. For you guys I'm just say for some of y'all, I'm gonna say I'm a Capricorn, but for me, my sign is the cross. Think. Think. What's your favorite season and why? <laughs> My favorite season. I'm not gonna lie, there are nice things in summer, but yo, I do not like, like I sweat way too much. And when I sweat, I do not feel pretty. I don't like it. It's better to feel, to like feel cold. Winter. I'm just gonna say winter, okay? Just because I don't want to talk too much, it's winter, okay? Cause with summer, I cannot control. Even if I'm naked, I'm still hot. I'm still hot. But if it's winter and it's cold, bra, I can wear a lot of things and I'm gonna be fine. So I'm gonna just say winter. But for like outings type vibe, I would say some dog winter. <laughs> Let me not complicate this whole thing. Winter. Uh, next question: What's one TV show you recommend to someone? Okay, let me plug y'all. <laughs> Hold on. Number one, Black Lightning. Number two, I'm gonna put them like okay. Here's the picture: Black Lightning. Number one. Number two, I'm not, it's not in any specific order. You can just chonga, watch whatever. Number two is a 911 Lone Star. That's a nice one. I ain't gonna lie, it's emotional, but it's nice. Uh, number three, let's go Korean style, her private life. <laughs> her private life. Listen, it's nice. Don't watch it in English though. It's not, mm mm. Mm mm. Watch it in Korean with the subtitles. Your one I will be up. Listen, yeah, whatever. Those are the three shows I recommend. Is there more? No. Oh, Viola, I'm joking. <laughs> I joke. It's just just a jokes, Ima. It's just a jokes. Next question: Your favorite top five YouTubers. Number one. Definitely has to be Aaliyah's face. Okay? Aaliyah. I love her. Like, if I'm stressed, I watch her. If I'm bored, I watch her. If I'm anything, it's just her. And her videos are long. That's what I like. One hour. Actually, it really takes time, eh? To vlog. And vlogging is a lot. But anyways. Number two... Um, so yeah, I'm gonna put the channels, you know. So number one is Aaliyah's face. Number two is Sylvia. I love her so much. Her fashion, her body, her hairstyle. <gasps> but yeah, number two is her. Number three is Fatima. Yes, sir. Number four. Kumi, 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 Kumi. I like her too. She's a South African YouTuber. And number five. Let me go to my YouTube and check. <laughs> number five is Kyra. 
Kyra, Kyra and Aaliyah's face are like same type of content. You get me, and I like them. I'm sorry. So there's only like one South African YouTuber from the five that I like or love. I literally had to go to YouTube just to check <laughs> my favorite. Anyways, okay, next question. How do you think 2024 is gonna be for you? I don't know. Yo, I said that. Um, it's gonna, uh, by God's grace, it'll be good. <laughs> Hopefully everything that I planned or expect for 2024 will happen. I want to look back like that is Emba. I want to look back into 2024 and be like period. I did that. For example, getting my driver's license. I need to do that. Shut up. I need to do that. But it's the studying. Yeah, Sana. Next question, um, why aren't you playing netball anymore? I get this question a lot. I got injured. <laughs> uh, I just got injured in a tournament. And yeah. But before I even got injured, the passion that I had for netball started to die around like grade nine. But I stayed, you know, I was fighting. I was fighting <laughs> because I got a bursary at that school. So I didn't want to just like, ah, netball, bye. No, I got a bursary. So I just like, let me just continue until grade 12. Then I'll decide what happens after grade 12. I couldn't just leave it because, yeah, I was at that school because of netball. So yeah, I had to force myself to love it again. <laughs> Just for those few years, yeah. Has your skin always been clear? Um, has my skin... I've never... I'm just gonna say I've never really had major problems with my skin. That's all I'm gonna say. Yeah. Who's the one person you look up to in terms of YouTube? Yeah, Elias face. That's the type of content I want to, like, give to y'all. You get me? It's actually a mixture. Ooh, Sana. It's a mixture of all of my favorite top five. You know, it's just a mixture. But mostly traveling. You get me? So, yeah. Um, next question. What does it take to get you... Uh, what question is this? What does it take to get you out of the house? Nothing. Not even man. I like being inside. You know what my problem is? I'm an introvert, ne? That has to be an extrovert. I really want to know people. I really want to get out of the house. I really, I really... Mara. You humans, you humans bore me like like bore. Like, you... Anyways, next question. <laughs> How tall are you? Hmm, I don't like this question. Because... I see here, I have to be honest. I don't know. <laughs> I really don't know. But if I were to like estimate or guess, probably like five seven, five eight. Mlambe, mlambe. I said maybe, maybe. Next question: What are you studying? I am currently within aviation industry, the aviation industry. So yeah. Try my best not to show this, but anyways. Are you in uni? No, I'm not. Uh, pizza or sushi? Do I look like a sushi girl? <laughs> like, come on. When you when when you look at me, do I look like I eat sushi? The thing is ugly, guys. <laughs> that thing is ugly. I do not know. I don't like it. It's it, no. Sorry, but it's not for me. Okay? Yeah. Next question. How are you holding up? I'm okay. Surprisingly. No, I'm joking. Not surprisingly, but I'm okay. Mm, yeah. 
I'm okay. Ah, uh, nothing to complain about. Yeah, I'm okay. I'm good. I'm good. I'm good. Uh, where do you are? Where do you see yourself in the next five years? Um, traveling. I see myself traveling in the next five years. Seeing new places, being in new places, learning new cultures, learning Jonga, eating different food. I want to go to places, guys. I want to travel, meet new people, you know, you know, breathe different air. You, <laughs> Sana. Come on, guys, like, let's go, let's go. But yeah, yeah, that's where I see myself in the next five years. Yeah. Okay, last question. How is boarding school? <laughs> okay, uh, boarding school is... <laughs> it's not bad. It's not bad. Okay, let me be honest now. Boarding school is not bad. Okay, you learn a lot of things. If it wasn't for boarding school, guys, I would have been... <sighs> a mess you get me like I would have been a mess it boarding school makes you like this it, you you become straight with everything in life in G. so you won't be jiga jiga no Ula. Ula. It will teach you about time management. You will have to know. You're going to have to be early. Okay, the one I went to. Early. Yo, Sana. Can't be late for things. If you're late, red slip. <laughs> for the people that did go to that school. You know. If you know, you know. Red slip. You will sign that red slip. Minus five points. Minus what, what points. If you do this, minus points detention for a yo guys a detention what well, wanna hard labor yeah. yo i've been to detention guys i know <laughs> so yeah but honestly speaking boarding school you just need to make it fun for yourself don't always be indoors don't uh, indoors don't always be in your room it's well like go to other people's rooms go like have fun when there's a, a disco night am i movie night um, don't always be inside looking at your books and you're looking at dog you'll go crazy meet people be friends with other people you get me plus it's easy to be friends with people there because like you have to be friends obviously start where or roommates okay for me i started at like athletics camp in grade eight so yeah it was easier went to athletics camp yeah that was the last question guys i hope you guys enjoyed this video okay share this video to your friends you know, you know the drill to do what support you girl support me guys but thank you guys for the questions uh thank you for everything thank you for watching thank you for tuning in if you've made it this far Yeah, but anyways, guys, thank you for watching. I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.